Peter, we're going to attack. How sick can it make it? <laughs> um, yeah, I'll be you're right. It's tough to watch, but um, I mean, it's a good, it's a good thing to watch and know to learn from. And um, you know, we made a lot of mistakes. We probably didn't prepare as well for that game, but uh, you know, we're going back and watching. You know, just you know, we, we expect them to do the same thing this year. Um, we're preparing for the worst, and uh, you know. I think we've done a really good job preparing for this game, and you know, I can't wait for a Monday. When you say you didn't do a good job enough job preparing last year, which was something we heard in, in there too from some of the coaches, was that just because of the youth of the team? Was that because they threw something at you you weren't used to seeing? What, what do you? What stands See, uh, out about that as you look yeah, back? Yeah, before that game, um, they really never played that defense before, so that's just something that kind of caught us off guard. Um, but you know, we, we like I said, we could have you know gone in and prepared a little bit better. Um, and that's what we're doing differently this year. You know, we're preparing for every defense, anything possibly that can be thrown at us, and um, we did really. We're, we've been doing really well with that. So Nick, is that a, is that? A, I hate to use the word revenge, but does that help you focus, knowing they beat you last year? Is that all part of it? Does that play a, a huge part? Absolutely. I mean, they came in our house, and you know, they embarrassed us. Um, so, you know, like you said, we want to. You know, we're out for revenge, and we want to go do the same thing to them. Nick, are you looking for a more increased role now with some of the suspensions at receiving core and the injury to Noah? Do you think you're going to get more targets now? Uh, absolutely. Um, you know, with the suspensions and you know Noah being out for the year, um, you know somebody's got to step up, and um, we got a lot of young guys who you know haven't really had that game experience yet. So I think they're kind of looking for the older guys, you know, to you know play a huge, play a huge role in this game. And um, you know, we're just going out there, just practicing every day as hard as we can, and just you know preparing as well as we can for this game. You got to talk about older guys, but he's an older guy that's new over there, and that's Braxton. Uh, what are you? Coach Meyer was saying he's looking more and more comfortable. What are you seeing uh, out of him at that position? Uh, he, I mean, he's taking his role seriously, and um, you know, every day, you know, he's uh, you know improving that you know, being a receiver. You know, his, his hands have gotten better. Um, you know, like I said, you know, he's really never done that before, and. Um, you know, he's going out there, you know, he's taking his role seriously, and um, I think he's going to be a huge factor in this game. Hey, Nikki, talk about practicing for everything that Virginia Tech might throw at you. Can you give us an example of maybe something, have you seen something in practice maybe that you're like, okay, not even the Hokies are going to try this? Just how deep has that gone? Um, I mean, you really never know because, you know, last year we didn't expect them to play that defense, you know, against us last year, so... Um, you just got to prepare for everything. Um, you never know what they're going to throw at us. You know, it's the first game, so um, you know, anything could happen. And uh, we're just doing our best to prepare for it. Can you give us an example of 